Hmm. Looks like you want to finally join into one of my videos, don't you? This is my cat, May, just so you guys know. She's made a couple cameos in some daily vacuuming videos. So, yeah, she, she's kind of photogenic. Well, sometimes she doesn't even realize it, but I think she low-key knows she's pretty much the star of my camera. What's up, everybody? Well, today I'm here to do another full house vacuuming to test vacuum performance. This time, it is going to be on my newly acquired Hoover Elite 600. This is one of the high-end 80s-style Hoover Elites. This was before they were, were called the Legacy, and they had the automatic hose conversion, or, or onboard tools in that matter. And this is one of the models that has a six amp motor, as opposed to the five amp that's in the Elite 350. And I, I was almost hesitant to do this video because I have already done of a vacuum similar, my Hoover Elite 2 6.0, which has the same 6 amp motor that this has. But I actually noticed something different. For one of them is the brush roll that's in this. See, this vacuum has its all original red bristle brush roll. It is in very good condition. One thing to note about this, this red bristle brush roll, compared to the white bristle one that you normally see in elites and even the green bristle one that that are mostly in hoover caddy vacs and later style hoover elites these bristles are medium stiff they're not as stiff as the white bristle but they're not as soft as the green bristle so it's going to be interesting to see how this performs compared to the the original white dual bristle brush roll with stiff bristles that my 6 amp elite 2 had also this one has a little bit different of a sole plate so it's going to be interesting to see how this fares compared to that elite 2 and to keep the contest fair like i always like to do i like to run a brand new hepa cloth synthetic bag this is one of the last of the hoover genuine hoover at that type a synthetic cloth hepa media bags i do not know why hoover decided to just kill off production to to these vacuums they are these bags excuse me they still make type y in hepa configuration but these type a's are no longer being manufactured by hoover don't know why when hoover decided to just screw people over and not offer cloth synthetic HEPA bags anymore even especially because they can fit your old machines like these elites the Hoover concept ones and the even some of the Hoover convertibles ran this style HEPA bag but anyway let's go ahead and get this thing in place As you can see the bag does have a nice rubber gasket around the collar for a very good seal push this on and into place all right it's all right it's on so anyway with that said now let's go ahead and get to full house vacuuming with this thing and I think May already knows, oh man, you're gonna do another vacuum. So, let's get to it. All right, so let's get to it.
All right, let's examine carpet lines here. These very beautiful carpet lines, just only a tiny little mark for where the belt sits. But other than that, this thing's leave really excellent carpet lines. This thing and is not self-propelled, but with the agitation of this brush roll, and also could be how long the bristles are, the vacuum basically pulls itself along the carpet. And I've only seen this happen with Hoover Elites. And even some single row brush rolls I've seen pull it across, pull themselves across the carpet. So that's just how great the agitation is on one of these.
vacuuming. So now, let's go ahead and unzip the bag and see what this guy picked up. Let me see if I can't get this thing off. This thing is sealed so tight on there. All right, I'll be back. All right, let's look inside. All right. I am fairly impressed. Let me see if I can open this a little bit more. I don't know if you can make out. There was a lot more fine dust towards the the bottom of the the bag so yeah that's just an idea of how how powerful even a even a six amp elite is and it runs very smooth i was informed by the by the by the seller who who sold me the this vacuum that the motor was freshly rebuilt so yeah, not only is it running smoother, but it definitely perform, performs excellent as well. Well, guys, hope you've enjoyed this full house vacuuming of the Hoover Elite 600. Be sure and stay tuned, and don't forget to like, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.